Yeah. Right, let's go out and get a couple of green bikes, beautiful things. Oh, cool, water pass. So we're gathering all the riders. We've got about 60, maybe 55. Uh-huh. So we've got a full field for the year. Continue out to Cunningham Head, it's a crossroads, you're turning immediately left and back into <laughs>
What are they? Your glasses are all full. Can I have your attention, please? Good afternoon. My name is Peter Cormack, and I'm the chairman of VC Glasgow South. Um, I want to present some prizes. Before I do so, however, I want to say some words of uh, thanks to a number of people. But before I even go there, there's one or two little bits of, of housekeeping. It's been a great day. Thank you, everybody, for coming, um, especially those people that were brave enough to put their wheels on the start line and really turn today into what I think was a really very, very good event indeed. Housekeeping issues, first of all, let's deal with the boring issues. Hopefully you've all picked up your race licenses after uh, the race. Hopefully you've all returned your transponders. There are snips at the front here if you need to uh, snip off those transponders and return those, those to us. And if you look to the back of the room there, there's still one wheel that remains unclaimed. If nobody claims it, then I'll take it. Oh, there we go. It's, it's going to Glasgow Green. First offer. Super. Um, today has been a good event. Glasgow South uh, has proudly put on this event for a number of years now. And of course, it's in the memory of John Davies, who was our uh, club chair chairman. So I'm really delighted to see so many people out here supporting an event that is really so dear to our hearts. We've got another event next weekend. A number of you have entered this already. We've got a 10 mile TT on the A77. That's next Saturday. All I will say is that the field is looking very strong indeed. However, there are still some places ready. So if today uh, didn't quite get all the energy out of you, then put your entries in. Entries close at the end of today, okay? So next Saturday on the 16th on the A77 course. One or two words of thanks because events like this will not happen of their own accord. And the major vote of thanks goes to Graham Kerr. It's over in the corner there, but he is our key organizer. So please, a big round of applause for Graham, please. These events only happen and they only run seamlessly uh, because of people like him. And he was up late last night dealing with some IT issues to make sure that everything went smoothly uh, today. So thank you again. We've got uh, some commissaires around. We've got lots of marshals as well. And hopefully you felt that today's course was uh, well policed. In inverted commas, plenty of visibility of marshals and really great support on the, the road as well. So from me and indeed from all the racers, a great big thank you to our commissaires and to our marshals. Thank you. Liz is hiding, but Liz, can you put your head out, please, or come round through the door? Come on. <laughs> uh, Liz is a very big supporter of this event as, as well, for reasons that you'll all uh, probably be aware of. Um, she has, uh, as always, come up with a really sparkling array of uh, sweet treats and uh, drinks as well. So please, from all of us, thank you very much, Liz. It's much appreciated. <laughs> We 
This is collecting donations for the thing, so if you enjoyed your cup of coffee and want to stick 20p into the pot or whatever, then feel free to do that. The event has also been sponsored by um, Dave Milet Motors. Dave provided generators. He was up very early this morning putting up various road signs and has also helped the, uh, the prize fund as well. So I don't know where Dave is. There he is with the blue cap. Thank you very much. Superb mechanic. Even better cyclist, and you'll find him in Thornley Bank if you're looking for the, the former. So let's come on to the, um, the prize giving, and there are five prizes to be awarded on the basis of one prize per uh, person. And I'm going to announce these in uh, reverse order. So we're going to give a prize to the first Cat 4, first Junior, and then third, second, and first. And the winner will take away the John Davies Memorial Road Dress Trophy. And hopefully, if we give the trophy to you and you give it back to us, we'll get your name inscribed there for time immemorial. So if each winner can please come up on stage because I've got something uh, to pass over to you. First, Cat 4 bearing in mind that we're offering prizes on the basis of one prize per person, is going to a rider from Glasgow Green Cycling Club to Colin Halliday. Congratulations. There you go. There you go. Well done. Thank you. He doesn't need to buy a new wheel, obviously, but... He can open the envelope nevertheless. Great to see juniors in the event, doing really, really well indeed. Um, the prize of first junior goes to a rider from North Sports, Kinesis, UK. So can I please invite Harry McGarvey to the front to collect his prize. Well done, congratulations. There you go. Well done. Watch out for this guy in 12 months' time. He's already going amazingly well. Congratulations. We had quite a finish. Um, the full stories of that will be told in due course. It includes um, sprinting. It includes um, orthodontistry, shall we say. We had um, a couple of amateur photographers around on the course. Uh, we had Gary Kelly and Stefan Krajcek, so we'll try and get images of today out to you as quickly as we can via Twitter and Facebook and so on. Um, and these guys, we had no... We had no photographers in the 100 metres after the finish line, so you can be rest assured on that front. Um, but these guys are uh, making photographs in their own spare time as a, as a hobby, uh, but you know they're both looking to do more of it, so if you can spread their um, interesting content further, that would be um, appreciated. Anyway, third place goes to a rider who's travelled from quite far away. He is from Shetland Wheelers. I remember speaking to him one year ago. Um, third prize goes to Robin Atkinson. Well done, Robin. Yeah, Congratulations. There you. you go. Yeah, there you go. Chuck it out. Second prize goes to a club that uh, has been mentioned already Glasgow Green Cycling Club. Second prize in the uh, race today was Alan Clark. Alan, here are you? Well done. Congratulations. So there's one winner, of course, and he has got many stories to tell from today, that's for sure. Um, it really gives me a lot of pleasure to present the prize for first place to the John Davies Memorial Road Race 
uh, for 2018 to a really deserving winner with an outstanding sprint finish from Pedal Power RT, John Hung. John. Well done, congratulations. You. There you go. That's for you. Okay, thanks. Sir. The envelope is only the half of it. This is the big prize. So, John, once again, there you go. Many congratulations. Thank you. I didn't really come in with expectations to win. Um, I was going to just uh, play my cards right today and sort of keep my powder dry, but. Um, after three to four laps, I realised that I was feeling okay, so there may have been a chance. And uh, when it came down to it, with the last turn to go, I knew there wasn't far for the max effort at the end, so um, gave it a shot. You know, in fact, we nearly got away with. Um, we were there was a, a three-man break with a couple of laps to go, and we uh, we just weren't quite strong enough to hold it out. But um, yeah, I just took my chances and. Uh, I was lucky in the end. Well, there are two stories to what happened over the line. The first is how I got over the line, which is um, as we came around the corner, uh, the guy from Shetland really went for it, and I just stuck onto his wheel and then took my chance at the right time. But then um, as I came over the line, I realised that I'd won, and I shouted yes, but as I did so, my, uh, my false tooth came out. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, this interview and half of the uh, photographs that have been taken have been without my, um, without my denture. <laughs> Many congratulations. Thank you.